Resetting Windows can help solve a lot of issues with your PC. If it's running poorly, loaded with malware, or you have other issues, then these problems can usually be fixed with a Windows Factory Reset, which will take your PC back to a clean state. Windows 11 has the same useful feature first found in Windows 10. In this video, I'll cover the different methods of resetting your PC and what they do. But before that, did you know Simply Nuck is running their biggest sale on the Platinum Snuck Book for Black Friday? Starting from the 23rd of November and running until Cyber Monday the 29th, you can get yourself one of these powerful workstations at a nice discount of $300 US, £200 or €200 Euro off. Featuring Intel 11th Gen processors and Nvidia's RTX 30 series graphics, these laptops have plenty of performance to offer. Did I mention the 240Hz display for some smooth, smooth gaming? I mean, work-related stuff? If you're interested in finding out more, click the link in the video description. Okay, so to begin the reset process, right-click your Windows Start button. Click Settings. Finally, scroll down and click Recovery. You can try running the Windows Troubleshooter first to see if that helps a specific issue. Have a look in Recommended Troubleshooter History if there's something there, or in other troubleshooters. Otherwise, click Reset This PC. Note that the options here tell you what's going to happen. Keep your personal files, but remove everything else. This means all the programs you've installed and any settings you have changed in Windows will be gone. However, any personal files you've saved should be left alone. I recommend backing up anything important just in case. The second option to remove everything is if there's nothing you want to keep on your computer. It's equivalent to turning on a brand new PC. Choose an option if you want to proceed. Next. There's the option of resetting either from the cloud or from your computer locally. The cloud option will download the latest build of Windows using your internet connection. The benefit of this option is that you'll have the latest version of Windows installed with all the updates. Local takes your current version and resets it. This requires no download. For this example, I'm going to choose local. You can review which apps will be removed and will need to be reinstalled. And after a while, there we are! A clean new version of Windows 11. If Windows says you don't have enough space to continue, you can delete files you don't need or delete some system files. To do that, right click on your main drive which has the Windows icon on it. Click Properties and Disk Cleanup in the General tab. You can select the items here to remove. Additionally, you can click Clean Up System Files. Removing these will give you even more space. Finally, you can also go into your Windows drive and then into the Windows folder. Click Software Distribution, then Download. Delete all the files found here. Don't forget to empty the recycle bin. If Windows gives you an error that there was a problem resetting your PC, try updating your version of Windows. Once you've got all the updates, try the factory reset again. And if you're still unable to reset your PC, you might want to consider installing Windows from scratch using a USB stick. I have an easy guide you can follow. Just make sure to back up anything important beforehand. But before you run off, just a quick reminder that you can save big on the Simply NUC Platinum Snuckbook for 6 days only. These units are based on the Intel NUC X15 laptop kit and are fully customizable with your choice of OS, RAM and storage. The 15.6 inch Full HD 240Hz display gives you some very high refresh rate gaming potential and the dual fan cooling system helps keep the system nice and quiet. Check out the link in the video description and that's all for this one. See you later. Cheers!